We defined excess supply as a position where quantity supplied is more than quantity demanded. Graphically, we can show it as follows, starting with our axis, demand curve downward sloping from left to right, supply curve upward sloping, and we have equilibrium price and equilibrium quantity. Excess supply will occur when the price is higher than equilibrium, say at a price of P1. Now at P1, quantity demanded would be at this level, quantity demanded, and the quantity supplied, if we go from P1 until it intersects the supply curve, this would be quantity supplied. So we see quantity supplied is more than quantity demanded, so we have excess supply. We see quantity demanded less than quantity supplied. Now what will happen if we have excess supply? Yes, there will be downward pressure on prices. And I want you to note, as prices come down, a signal will be sent to consumers and they will react to the decrease in price. And how do they react? Yes, the quantity they buy will increase. So the decrease in price will lead to an increase in quantity demanded. And that can be shown by movement along the demand curve. At the same time, the decrease in price also sends a signal to the suppliers. And how do they react? Yes, they decrease the quantity they're willing to supply. And that decrease in quantity supplied is again shown by a movement along the supply curve. And these movements will keep on as long as quantity supplied is more than quantity demanded. The downward pressure will carry on and exist until quantity demanded is equal to quantity supplied, in other words, until equilibrium is reached at PE.